Good morning, everyone. This is Donnie from Creek Walker Trading. Today's test, I'm going to be using my uh, static tip recurve, the wild hog. Uh, reason is we have a lot of wild hogs in Florida, and uh, they like to live around the creeks, and I thought that would go good with the Creek Walker. Plus, these curves kind of remind these tips kind of remind me of a wild hog's tusk. So, uh, the arrows I'm using. This bow is 45 pounds at 28 inches. I'm drawing right at 28 inches. These arrows I'm using, first one, 55 pound spine, uh, cedar, I believe this is a cedar arrow. Here's another uh, shaft, I think this is also cedar, and it is 65 pound spine. And then I have 2114 aluminum arrows. Uh, this bow, for some reason, it's not cut past center or nothing, but it still likes really stiff arrows. All right, thank you. Check out creekwalkertrading.com. Hello everyone, Donnie Wilkerson, Creek Walker Trading. Uh, today, I want to test the sound difference of the arrow between two wooden shafts that have shield uh, feathers on them, one four inch and one five inch, an aluminum shaft with some parabolic, parabolic five inch feathers. Let's see what they sound like. So there wasn't a huge difference in the noise, but the loudest, as far as I could tell, was the aluminum shaft. It actually sounded like a metal arrow. Uh, the second one to me was this uh, one with a four inch. It's a little lighter spined shaft, um, about the same length though. <clears throat> and then the quietest one was this stiffer shaft. Now. This one I have shot quite a bit, so it's the feathers are kind of worn down on it somewhat. So that might have made a difference. Not sure. Take care. Check out creekwalkertrading.com.